back in the top 25 this week. I guess what does that mean just you know, being there? I know it's you know, more about maybe the end of the season where you guys are in March, but just at this point, you know, having that national you know, prominence and, and being in that conversation, what does that mean as a team to, to be in the top 25? I mean, it's just, you know, the hard work is like, you're starting to show. So I feel like just getting a not notification on a no national level is just like, it's just showing that hard work is really paying off for us, I would say. How much do you, I guess, embrace that without getting too caught up in a, in a place where, you know, that kind of performance is, is obviously you want to make it more of an expectation? Uh, we just really just try to focus on what we're doing in practice and um, not worry about what we're receiving on a national level. And, just lock in what coach tells us to do. Uh, what do you remember being in the being at Bankers Life last year at the end of that game? Uh, to, to, what was that like to, to watch that? Uh, just to see that and be a part of that, just watching that amazing performance and being a part of it, just us coming back and fighting hard and getting that win at the end of the day, it was just amazing. It was like one of a kind atmosphere. So I feel like just being a part of that was really great. Your two co-captains. Uh, Made a play with the best free throw. Talk about that. Most definitely, Zach grabbed the rebound, dropped it off to Jamo. He dunked it, and the whole, the whole place just exploded. And I feel like that's when we felt like we really had it, and we just went off of the energy that they, after that amazing play that Zach made, and it just took care of itself after that. Rob, it's been a while since not that long since you've been recruited by Butler. What did you respect about about that program, and what what did you like about what they did there? Oh, uh, yeah. I know I was recruited by them with uh, Coach Seven. I said Ohio State now, but I mean, just them being the underdog and um, coming in looking to knock off top ranked opponents, I really respected that. And uh, just the atmospheres, atmospheres they had at games, it was uh, pretty good. What do you guys need to do to stop all of them? Uh, really just play team defense and um, just lock in, really, and um, just help each other. Kind of going off of that, what impresses about you guys about their backcourt in general, not just him, but Jorgensen and the other guys? Uh, they're really great players. You know, we got to lock in and key in on their tendencies and keep going it over with the team, and we just keep working on it in practice and just make sure we execute the game plan that coach brings to us. Have you guys kind of taken advantage of this this time? Obviously, it's a you know, balance with finals week and everything, but coach kind of talked about the importance of you know, when you guys are practicing, like really practicing hard and things like that. Just how do you? Managed to take advantage of that time when you are in practice? Uh, you know, we studying for finals, coming in, practicing. So we try to take advantage of the time we got on the court because you know how finals can be. So we just try to take advantage of the time on the court, go over things that we need to, and just try to make the most of what we got. Rob? Oh, really just. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's your first set of finals. Yeah, just, just take time and rest. And, um, we just get a lot of sleep and um, we just not do. Things that are stupid. So, 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 so you're not pulling all nighters. No. Uh -huh. <laughs> Rob, what's it going to be like playing in Bankers Life in an in-state battle against Butler? Uh, I know it's going to be it's going to be pretty surreal. Just all the in-state schools. I know I'm from from Indiana, so uh, just going in there. And the last time I was there, besides a uh, close scrimmage, was the state championship. So I know it's going to be a great atmosphere, and I'm just really looking forward to it.